Hello friends, we are going to draw a flow chart to calculate the sum of the mix of the given number. This is a logical start on the flow chart. I am obtaining a number from the user as an input. input n now I am utilizing a variable sum equal to 0 comma r equal to 0 I am utilizing two variables I am checking If, if n greater than 0, if n greater than 0 true means true means true means the remainder R equal to N R equal to N mod root 10. Next, sum equal to sum plus r sum equal to sum plus r so next n equal to n divided by 10 this is integer division as I am connecting back to the relation statement so n greater than n is greater than 0 is true means r equal to n modulo 10. So n modulo 10 will return the remainder of the given number that will be get stored in the variable r. Sum equal to sum plus r. Okay, the value will get added in the sum. Initial value of sum equal to 0, 0 plus remainder. n equal to n by 10 is integer division. Okay. So after again it will be checked n greater than 0 condition is true. Again the remainder is calculated, the remainder will get added in the sum and n equal to n by 10, then one digit will be removed. Okay, this is an integer division. We will see how it works in an example. Then, if n greater than 0 false, this is false. False means what I am doing, I am printing, printing sum. The sum will get printed. Then this is the logical end of the flowchart. We'll see how it works. We keep start input n and giving n equal to one fifty three. Sum equal to zero or equal to zero. Sum equal to 0, R equal to 0. So we check 153 greater than 0. 153 greater than 0. This is true. Then R equal to N mod root 10. Remainder R equal to 153 mod root 10. The remainder is 3. Sum equal to sum plus r. What is the existing value of sum is 0. 0 plus the remainder is equal to 3. Sum equal to existing value of sum plus 3 equal to 3. Value of sum equal to 3 now. n equal to n divided by 10. This is an integer division. That means 
n equal to 153 divided by 10 or this is 15.3 integer division the rational part will get omitted n equal to 15 from the check 15 greater than 0 15 greater than 0 is true then remainder equal to n modulo 10 r equal to 15 modulo 10 equal to 5 then sum equal to sum plus r sum equal to what is the existing value of sum is 3 then remainder 5 sum plus r 5 which is equal to 8 n equal to n divided by 10 that is integer division n equal to 15 divided by 10 integer division 1 by n fraction part we get omitted n equal to 1 okay. 1 greater than 0 1 greater than 0 is true r equal to n modulo 10 r equal to n modulo 10 means okay, 1 modulo 10 will return the remainder equal to 1 sum equal to sum plus r what is the existing value of sum it is 8 sum equal to 8 plus 1 is 9 n equal to n modulo 10 this integer division okay n equal to 1 divided by 10 0 point 1 this becomes 0 okay 0 greater than 0 false it will print the sum okay the 9 will get printed 9 is your output and flow chart will start what is your input 153 is your input. So output is 9. What is that? How 9 comes? 1 plus 5 plus 3. 1 plus 5 6. 6 plus 3 is 9. So here it is added like 3 plus 5 plus 1. 3. Here 3. 3 plus 5 8. Okay. 8 plus 1 equal to 9. So 9 is the output. So flowchart is working perfectly. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Share, comment and press the bell button. Thank you.